Are you getting the no direct 12 adaptive found error when launching GTA V Enhanced? If so, you're not alone, but don't skip this video because I will show you exactly how to fix it step by step. Watch till the end, or you might miss a crucial fix that could make all the difference. Before we fix it, let's quickly understand why this error happens. VLR underscore GFX underscore D3 D N O D3 D1 to error appears because your graphics card doesn't support Direct 12 or it's not enabled. Your GPU drivers are outdated, Direct 12 is corrupted or missing on your PC. Windows or GTA V Enhanced isn't updated. First, let's confirm whether your graphics card supports Direct 12. Press Windows plus R, type Dexiag, and hit Enter. Under the Display tab, check the feature levels. If you don't see 12 underscore 0 or 12 underscore 1, then your GPU doesn't support Direct 12 and you'll need to upgrade. If your GPU supports Direct 12 but the error still shows up, it could be outdated drivers. Here's how to update them. For Nvidia, go to GeForce Experience greater than check for updates. For AMD, open Adrenaline software and update drivers. Restart your PC and try launching GTA V Enhanced again. Sometimes, Direct 12 files get corrupted, so let's reinstall them. Go to Microsoft's official Direct download page. Download and install Direct 12. Restart your PC and check if GTA V launches without the error. If you're still stuck, forcing the game to run in Direct 11 can be a quick workaround. Open Rockstar Launcher. Go to Settings Greater Than and GTA V. In launch arguments type DX11 and say try launching the game again. Your Windows version might be outdated. To fix this, go to settings greater than update and security. Click check for updates, install any pending updates and restart your PC. If none of the fixes works, your game files might be corrupted. Try reinstalling GTA V enhanced completely. It takes time but it's often the final solution. Install any pending updates and restart your PC. And there you have it. If this video helped, hit like, drop a comment, and subscribe for more GTA fixes. If you're still facing issues, let me know in the comments and I'll help you out.